Seen a lot of talk on the forums and on Facebook lately about what guys are doing for knee pads. Well, I've tried a lot of different knee pads. I know a lot of guys are going for the Arc'teryx, if that's how you say it, but I'm just a simple middle class guy and I'm not about ready to spend $70 on knee pads when I can save that money and go out west and hunt antelope or something else with it. So I've looked at a lot of budget knee pads, stuff that's under 25 bucks. And really, for the longest time, I kept coming back to these very simple foam knee pads. Yeah, they were Velcro, but I put them on in my car and, and they did the job. Sometimes I would use, instead of these, a foam uh, tree seat uh, just on a rope or a cam strap or something around the tree and that worked out. But recently, I have bought a new option. These are the Trophy Line Vintage Knee Pads. They're about 25 bucks from Trophy Line's website, and I think they are just fantastic. I'm gonna zoom in here, show you a little bit about them, some of their key features. I think they are the best bang for the buck as far as knee pads go in the saddle hunting world right now. Okay, here's a close up of the two knee pads. First thing you're gonna notice is that they're camouflage, which I kinda like match the rest of your, your outfit. Second thing that I think is probably the most important feature is that they are silent buckles. So they just loop over these little pegs and then you can cinch them down tight on your legs. The straps are nice elastic so you, you can get them really, really tight on, on your legs. There's a upper and a lower attachment point so they cup your knee really, really well. The second thing, they come with interchangeable front pads here, I guess you could say. They just peel off, so this is not something you're gonna wanna do you know, in the tree. But Velcro, this particular one is kind of, you can see that, it's soft. I, I, it, it's not plastic, but it's not rubber. It's kind of something in between, I'm not exactly sure. This is probably what I would use, but they also come with these harder, plastic cap. So if you're a guy that, that maybe you've worked on concrete your whole life and you got bad knees or you've had replacements, this would probably provide a little bit more support and it just lays down there on that Velcro and you've got a totally different feel and look to the knee pad. That one there is a little bit longer too. You can see that they're probably half an inch longer and significantly wider than the rubber ones. So that's a nice feature. But the one thing I didn't realize about these by looking online that I wanted to point out to you guys is just how much padding they have in them. If you pull this back, you can see that there's a significant amount of foam, two or three layers of foam in there, and they, they are just very, very plush. Super, super comfortable on the tree. And for 25 bucks, I think they're a fantastic option for the guy that doesn't want to spend $70 on knee pads. Check them out, worth your money. Trophy Line's done a great job bringing these to the market. I think they're the best option out there right now.